Hello everyone. In this session, we will discuss some more important points regarding the border plan. So, in the previous discussion, we will consider some points here. The first point is, initial slope of the plot is given by poles and zeros location at the origin. That means, poles and zeros location at the origin means 1 by S, 0 location at the pole location at the origin RES are 1 by s square and s square these are the poles and zeros location at the origin for that condition slope how the slope will be varied if one pole at origin are finite if the one pole is available at the origin then the slope will become minus d 20 db per decade that means this is 1 by s 1 by s means down it goes to down that is minus 20 db per decade if 1 0 at origin that means yes s is there s is there means plus 20 db per decade okay 1 by s means minus 20 db per decade if the yes is there plus 20 db per decade yes then what is the change in the phase phase if the pulse is available if the poles for the poles phase is always minus 90 n okay if the zeros are available for any zeros it will be represent plus 90 n okay for poles minus 90 n phase we have for zeros we have plus 90 n for example if the poles are 2 if the poles are 2 then the phase will be minus 90 into 2 that means phase become minus 180 because poles poles is represents always minus if the this is for the poles if we have the same thing zeros is 2 then the phase is plus 90 into 2 then it become the plus 180 that means zeros always numerator that will give positive values poles always in the denominator that will give negative values it may be magnitude or it may be the phase okay these are the some important points okay next what is corner frequency what is the corner frequency the frequency at which slope changes from one level to another level the slope some slope will be changed from one level to another level at which frequency it will be changed that is called the corner frequency okay that is called the corner frequency so this corner frequency also useful to draw the border plot so in this look at the first problem the first problem is the problem is gh of s open loop transfer function has s by 1 plus s by 10 whole square 1 plus s by 50 whole cube so this is the transfer function we need to draw the border plot we need to draw the border plot border plot means you know that we have to draw the two plots one is the magnitude plot another one is the phase plot magnitude plot and the phase plot so we need to draw magnitude as well as phase so before that we should recognize the corner frequencies we should recognize the corner frequencies so look at here this is the uh, simply pole at the here the pole at so not pole this is the zero at numerator zero at origin if it if the s is here that is the pole at the origin so first we will recognize the corner frequencies so how many corner frequencies we have the corner frequencies is i will take there is no corner frequency this has the corner frequency i will take w1 equal to 2 and after that corner frequency is the 10 so go for the ascending order w2 equal to 10 what is the next corner frequency 20 that is the w3 equal to 20 and what is the next corner frequency w4 is the 50 and next corner frequency is 100 that is w5 is 100 
okay so better to write here only that may be useful for the drawing so 20 w4 equal to 50 and w5 equal to 100 w6 equal to 200 okay look at here 2 10 20 50 100 200 these are the corner frequencies look at here what is corner frequency corner frequency is nothing but at slope changes from one level to another level next we will go for draw the magnitude plot the first magnitude plot is always take initial is the point one initial point is the point one after that and why you should take point one in order to represent the one after that you should do one after that you will consider the all the corner frequencies so corner frequencies is 2 10 20 50 100 200 look at here 2 10 20 50 100 200 okay these are the corner frequencies right so at point one at point one generally so this is the point one so take it this is the point one so uh, remove this all right so at point one always magnitude is the zero db magnitude is the better to change the pen here yeah this is the zero db this is the point magnitude always you can take anything it will be zero and and you you have to look at where is the initially is the zero initially we have the zero zero means it has plus 20 db plus 20 db starting from here plus 20 db means it should be increased it should be in this manner okay so this may be the plus 20 db so this is the plus 20 db okay yeah we don't know what is this magnitude but the magnitude is it will be increases to plus 20 db up to second corner frequency this is the 20 db per decade why it is 20 db per decade why it is 20 db per decade because of here at two corner frequency it will be changed but at starting one will be it will be zero and before that we have the some pole at zero that why it will be plus 20 db we don't know the magnitude actually okay we don't know the magnitude next at second corner frequency look at here w1 equal to 2 we have w1 equal to we have one pole one pole means minus 20 db will be slope will be changed to minus 20 db per decade so here minus 20 db per decade means so the slope is like this the slope is like this this and this both will be become neutral both will become the neutral okay then it will become 0 db it will become the 0 db right after that at corner frequency 10 look at it at corner frequency 10 we have two zeros we have two zeros means 2 into plus 20 db per decade will be added 2 into 20 db per decade then it will be 40 db per decade so here the 40 db will be added 40 db means maybe it may be like this this will be the 40 db per decade this is the 0 this is the 20 okay 40 db so this will be increases right after that at 20 at 20 look at here at 20 corner frequency we have two zeros we have two zeros we have two zeros means we have two zeros means minus 20 db per decade that means it become minus 40 db per decade 
so so it will be decreases it will be decrease this plus 40 and minus 40 will become neutral so again up to 50 it will become the neutral so this week this become 0 db again okay next after that at 50 look at at 50 we have the three poles at 50 we have the three so 2 3 into 20 db per decade then it will become 60 db per decade is the slope so that's why the slope is increases increases like this up to 100 so that's why it is the 60 db per decade up to the 100 yes next uh, after the 60 at 50 over at 100 at 100 frequency we have the again three poles so that means 3 into minus 20 db per decade then slope will become minus 60 db per decade okay so look at here so this is minus 60 db and this is also same it will be decreases or minus 60 plus 60 and minus 60 will be added again the neutral point again the neutral point that means it will become 0 db it will become the 0 db next what about 200 at 200 at 200 look at here at 200 corner frequency we have four four zeros so that is 20 db per decade then become the plus 80 db per decade so automatically it will be increases so 80 db means maybe like this so this is the plus 80 db per decade okay this is the procedure to draw the this is the procedure to draw the border plot magnitude plot so don't confuse here just just take so just look at here at corner frequency to minus 20 db slow will be compare with the added to the previous frequency same at and look at how many number of poles are available or how many number of zeros are available the 2 is multiply with the 2 then the slope is become like this and by using that we will draw the border plot like this and next we will draw the phase plot also we will draw the phase plot also how we will draw the phase plot a simple thing at omega equal to, up to omega equal to we have 1 look at here we have 1s one, 1 0 at origin 1 0 at origin means 1 0 will be there plus 90 is there up to second corner frequency at corner frequency 2 at corner frequency 2 we have the one pole look at here one pole one pole means plus 90 will be added here plus 90 is there it will be added minus 90 here minus 90 okay then plus 90 minus 90 is become the zero up to 10 up to 10 at this point minus 90 will be added and at a 10 at 10 corner frequency two poles will be added two means up to it will become the 180 up to it will become the 180 so this is the 180 this is 90 and the this is the 180 okay next at 20 con at 20 what is the value at 20 corner frequency again it will become my mi minus we have the two we have the two so we have the two then you should minus 180 you should add here the minus 180 plus 180 is there you should add minus 180 plus 180 minus 180 become either zero zero next at 50 at 50 we have the three three means 390s it become 270 270 means so you should add the 270 here plus 270 here whenever you add the 270 then 
this is the one part and this is the another part this is the another part one part another part and another part so this will be increases like this be 270 okay after that after 100 we have the 200 is there so look at there for 200 we should add the 4 for 200 we should add the 4 after 100 at 100 so look at at 100 where is the 100 is there 100 100 means you should decrease three times because we have the three poles are there that means you should add minus 270 here already we have plus 270 and the minus 270 it will become the zero for up to 200 what about 200 at 200 it will become 4 4 means 490s it will become the 360 so you should add the 360 here whenever you should add the 360 here it will become like this 360 here okay you should add the 360 here so this is the procedure to draw whenever a transfer function is given if you ask to draw the border plot this is the magnitude plot and this is the phase plot okay i hope all of you understand this session thank you